What's going on, everybody? I am 72 hours sober. So this is what life is like. This shit is boring, to be perfectly honest. So I woke up in the middle of the night last night. As some of you may or may not know, when you stop smoking weed, sometimes you'll start to have nightmares. And um, the funny thing is, this round, I haven't had any, but I've had some really wild dreams. So I woke up in the middle of the night and I wrote them down. In yesterday's vlog, I told you about how I met one of my heroes and he actually wasn't a dickhead, which is... It's very rare. In this, in this dream I had, I was walking towards some water on a beach and I kept walking into the water and then I turned around and I was trapped in the middle of the ocean. It's one of my biggest fears. And I turned around and Drake was there. Yeah, Drake, that Drake. Drake? Yeah. Drake, I think we're trapped in the middle of the ocean. Go where? Let me see what I can do. Champagne pot. Drake got out of the boat or whatever we were in and he walked on water to safety. I'm having multiple dreams now. Then I had a dream that I broke my sobriety. I took one tiny hit, probably some AGL, and my mind just went, it turned to mush. Then I had another dream, that's three dreams, that I was FaceTiming with somebody in my mother's um, kitchen. So I'm FaceTiming, we're talking, and then one of my friends shows up, and he starts banging on the back door. What's going on? I brought strippers. What? He brought strippers, and they were shaking everything in, in the, on the back porch, and I was like, oh my god, and I woke up. So let's check in later today and see what happens. I completely forgot how fast I drive when I'm sober. Clocking in at 74. Still alive. Sober feet are very heavy. Very heavy. Uh, guys, my eyes are up here. Thanks. Uh, so I am ironically 86 hours sober right now. I know that's crazy. I think last year or the year before I might have hit 100. So that's 14 hours away. But. I actually don't have the urge to smoke right now. I'm noticing things about myself. I'm learning things about myself. I'm finding out things that I would not have found out unless I was sober. In my experience personally, people who know you smoke weed and know you love to smoke weed, people in general who truly know you, they'll be able to hurt you. They'll be able to take advantage of you. Nipsey said, people learn you just to hurt you. That's true. That's the truth right there. There's a reason he's not here anymore. He was telling the truth. That's another story. So I feel like it's like my third eye is opening. Yep. 86 hours sober, so that's cool. I'm really feeling like I'm, I'm a hop, skip, and jump right over 100, and my aim is um, to clear 200. So we're gonna see what happens, but so far I'm doing really well. I do not want any alcohol, I don't want any weed, but I love weed. I mean, you know that. Anyway, we're gonna check in tomorrow and see how we're doing. But good night, everybody.